Hey guys, I'm going to start cleaning up and trimming on this dash on this 1978 Chevrolet C10 truck. This one is going to pose some more problems than the 84 C10 truck I worked on. Reason being, the cracks are so big and they're kind of humped up. I've already started working on this. I've even had to cut the foam right in here to try to, I'm going to try to make it lower or level than what it is now. As you can see, I've got lots of sun damage and heat damage on this. And it's going to take me quite a while, but I was just going to show you what I'm up against. This is probably, if this is not the worst dash I've ever seen, it's close to it. Anyway, I've got my work cut out for me. I need to try to make this cover lay dash cover lay down as flat as I can so the glue will adhere real well and stick to this. So this is what I'm doing. I thought I'd just give you a heads up. I'm using putty knife and I'm using this little straight edge here and I've got these gloves on so I don't accidentally cut my hand while I'm doing this stuff. But a lot of it right up through here, like this right here, I can just push down with my finger. You can hear it break. But I've got to get it just as level as I can and then clean this dash as good as I can. So uh, the, the silicone from the, that cover lay provided will lay down here and cover up all this mess. Okay, just thought I'd give you a short video of what I'm doing today. And this might take me a while, so. Man, what a mess. But I'm just trying to keep in mind, since I made that video yesterday, of how good it's going to look when I get all this mess covered up. Y'all have a good day. I'm having a really good day. Good to be alive. Good to be able to do this. I'll see you later.